Hello everyone. Today I want to talk about a book by Dr. Eva Hoffman by the title My Ethical Hero, Janusz Korczak. Let me give you a brief introduction of who he is. Janusz Korczak is a hero in the terms of the war against Hitler and he was the one who had actually adopted 200 orphan kids and he ran on orphanage. He was a doctor. He had multiple offers from all his rich Polish friends to escape Poland and run away. But instead, he decided to stay back. And ultimately, they are all put in a train along with the children uh, and their journey to Treblinka, which ultimately must have led to their horrific death in the hands of Nazi. So she actually writes about everything that comes out of his memoirs, his short story fiction, his writings. She has done a good job about uh, describing who he was as a person. And here she talks about how he runs his orphanage for Jewish children in Warsaw, Poland, like a microcosmic democracy. The children had their own parliament newspaper and court in which they debated transgressions against the school's code and suitable penalties. So if anybody was violating rules, what should they do? Uh, they were their own parliament. They had their newspaper. They had their own little court to decide penalties. Although these were not really implemented based on the sympathetic understanding of each child's background and inner world. In effect, Korsak was administering an education in natural justice and ethical psychology. So just uh, he's also one of my heroes and I have written about him, which I will leave a link below if you are interested to understand uh, his teaching style and what kind of a human being he was. Um, and he believed in the full dignity of children, you know, because of their need for love and dignity. So here um, he says what has happened at the end is even though they know what is going to happen ultimately, they stuck together with each other. And uh, in spite of every upheaval, he tries to feed the children. But the biggest thing he does is nourishes their inner spirit. There's a mention of him performing a play by Ravindranath Tagore about a child's death so that it can mentally prepare the children of their eventual death. Because, um, you know, it's very difficult for children to understand the concept of death. And uh, so he actually uses this. So he actually uses this post office. Okay, he uses this post office uh, uh, story written by Ravindra Tagore in 1912 and he adapts this into a play for the children to understand the meaning of death. So his profound courage and his rigorous compassion held till the very end. So he knew that if he stuck there longer with the Jewish kids, he was going to be taken to the Tribalanka where people were just put to their horrific deaths. They were just going to be burnt alive but he knew what was going to happen he still stuck to the poor kids 200 of them and he was their hero so thank you bye